All right, thanks, Dan. According to the CDC, drug overdose deaths are down in North and South Carolina, the first decline we've seen since 2018. 7 News reporter Ariana Meadows talked with the Anderson County Coroner's Office about what is going on with this decline. The Anderson County Coroner's Office says there is a decrease in accidental drug overdose deaths. Last year there were 89. There have been 18 so far this year. The coroner says Narcan is the biggest factor saving lives in drug overdoses. Our law enforcement, our firefighters, our EMS workers, uh, they are seeing these overdoses in an alarming rate still, but we're seeing more people saved by the interventions of the Narcan and the first responders. Uh, focusing on getting there quickly and getting that administered. Even though drug overdose deaths are declining, they say the work is not over yet. The Narcan program, I think, has helped save lives, but it hasn't helped uh, those that have these addictions. That's our next phase. We need to focus now on funding organizations that are helping those that are uninsured or underinsured. Throughout the year, we're told law enforcement agencies and other community partners have worked to spread awareness about the dangers of drugs, providing free Narcan kits and CPR training. The purpose of having these conversations is because addiction don't discriminate. It could hit anybody's home, and I feel like our whole uh, community needs to be educated on it because we don't need to wait till it touches my house before I know what to do with it. The coroner tells us he's concerned about the homeless population not having access to health care. I think now we need to be focused on how we can get funding to the agencies that work to help these people in detoxification and recovery. Recovery centers say they've seen a positive change. I do think that it would be far greater of a number if there was not Narcan. I think that many overdoses are reversed because of Narcan and people have another chance to live. Um, but I think without that, it's a, a number that we probably don't want to see. Officials say there are free Narcan kits available at the Anderson County Coroner's Office. In Anderson County, Ariana Meadows, 7 News. And the coroner's office says it received a $45,000 grant from the opioid settlement. They're using that money to talk with schools, organizations, and to speak at community events trying to spread the awareness.